In this video we will tell you how to use Bima Book application. First open the Bima Book app then log in through email ID. You are now on the home page of the Bima Book app. Notifications. You can see all types of notifications alerts by clicking the bell icon. Manage customer. In this option you can manage your customers and can also add new customers. To add a new customer, you have to fill the customer's information and then save it. You can also send a normal or WhatsApp message to your customer to connect with you. From here you can see the saved information of customers and can also edit it. Manage policy. With this option you can manage the policies of your customers and also add new policies of customers. To add a new policy, you have to select the customer and then fill the policy information, then save it. In this also you can give information about the policy to your customer with normal or WhatsApp message. Now the policy has been added. By clicking on the policy, you can see its information and can also edit or delete it. Manage sub-agents. From here you can manage sub-agents and add new sub-agent. Here you can fill the information of the subagent and save it. You can view the saved subagent's information and you can also edit or delete it. Manage leads. You have four options to manage leads. In the first option you can create a new lead. For this you have to fill the customer details and save it. After saving it the lead will open. In the second option you can view, edit, delete and change the leads status, success failure of the created leads. Then click on mark as done. In follow up you can set the date of call or meeting with customer. You can also give this information to the customer through a message. In the third option, those leads will come which we close, which are success closed leads, we can add those customers to our customer list. In today follow ups, you can see with which customer you have to attend call or meeting today. Manage policy plan. In this you can manage policy plans and add a new policy plan. Fill the information of the new policy plan and save it. Here you can see the information about the policy plan and you can also edit or delete it. Manage purchase party. In this option you can manage purchase parties and can add new purchase party. Fill in the details of the new purchase party and save it. In this also you can see the information of purchase parties and you can also edit or delete it. Insurance news. In this option you can see latest news about insurance. Greetings. In this option you can send greetings to your customers. Like birthday anniversaries, festivals, special days, motivational, etc.
Now go to more option. Here you will see your name, email ID and your plan information at the top. View profile. In this option you can check your profile information. Here you can also put a link to your Facebook profile and YouTube. By clicking on this link, you can check the mini website of your profile. You can also share your mini website with the button given below, share link. In my services, you can add your services to your profile. The added services will also be reflected in your mini website. After making changes click on save. Set custom SMS. In this you can turn off on the messages going to the customers. Manage backup. In this, you can update the backup and you can also import the backup when the device is changed. Import customers and policies. To import customers and policies, you have to download the sample file. Customers and policies information has to be filled in it and then that file has to be imported. Privacy policy. In this you can read the app privacy policy. View subscriptions. In this you can buy the plan of the app. If you have any problem in making payment, you can get help on WhatsApp by clicking on the button below, get payment help. Contact us. In this too, if you have any kind of problem related to the app, customer support can message on WhatsApp. You can log out by clicking the last button. Thanks for watching video. Don't forget to like the video, comment and subscribe the channel.